We're going on a bear hunt. Uh, treasure hunt. I meant treasure hunt. We're going on a treasure hunt. Uh, anyway, so for those of you that haven't been here in a while, and well, actually nobody has seen these before because I made these off camera and it was a bit of a pain in the backside. Uh, they're not very difficult to build, but you know, it kept becoming nighttime all the time and then this one over here, like a creeper came up and blew me up and eh, it was good times. It was, it was, it was, it was stressful stressful times anyway so as i said before we're going on a treasure hunt because a manchu has left us a little surprise i had to use my shulker box to get up there on a on little silly johnson jr's memorial there right so if we come in here someone left why is there a horse in my map excuse me buddy can you oh no Right, don't ride horses and maps, they'll kill you. So, I assume, oh you can see, I did update the maps. You can sort of see the, the rainbow butterfly over there. Um, I assume this was silly, I think, maybe. Or a Manchu? One of them, I believe, because there were not maps at my base before. But, if you come over here... Cat's treasure map. And I got a clue that said, look... Or a tree that doesn't belong but I am uni unilaterally unilat unilaterally bad let's go sleep first I am very very bad at finding treasure especially in bedrock Yes, I'm very, very bad at finding treasure or clues in general or riddles or anything of that sort. So I imagine it's over here. Look for a tree that doesn't belong. There's like a red dot over here. Right, I'm, I'm going to have to put the map back down here because this is... Maps are very annoying. Right. Look for a tree that doesn't belong. <laughs> Managed to save you guys from me sneezing into my microphone. Yay! Right. Oh, and up here I did some lanterns. Don't know if I'm going to do more lanterns or if that's enough lanterns, but it took a lot of scaffolding and frog light placing and trap doors. But now I've been left with a crap ton of trap doors that you know, I need to use, so I might need more lanterns. Look for a tree that doesn't belong. We're going to get onto this map and see if the tree is on this map. So while we wait for Horsey to make its way over to spawn and hopefully get onto uh, that map that we're, you know, trying to do the whole treasure hunt thing about, uh, here is a clip of me actually putting the lanterns together. And as you can see, it wasn't very complicated. I mean, there's like a lot of scaffolding involved, but it was a pretty simple progress. It was just a bit fiddledy trying to place the trap doors, obviously crouch and place them, and then work out in which direction to make the lanterns go. So I wanted them going 
sort of towards the tower and obviously if anybody's seen Tangled uh, the whole premise of that is that Rapunzel has been kidnapped by Mother Gothel and the whole reason she decides to escape is to go see these lanterns for her birthday that the King and Queen release on her birthday every year to sort of commemorate their lost daughter uh, and she has you know an inherent feeling that these lanterns are for her which is obviously correct but it's not like that in the real world. The lanterns are not for you. So, you know, don't 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 run away, go looking for some weird ass lanterns. Uh but anyway, yeah. Like I I'm quite happy with them, but I do think I am gonna add more and I don't know if I'm gonna keep them with the same colour or add extra colours. I will probably just keep them in the okra. Okra. Uh so yeah, and as you can see, there's one of the butterflies that I'd already made. Uh, behind me, and that guy was a pain. Right, I am going to leave Horsey on board the Titanic for now. Stay, Horsey. Right, and then I'm going to go grab an Elytra. We'll see if we can get on this map. Right. I need an ender chest, so I did leave one in the trading barn, if there isn't one at spawn. Yeah. Let's go get the ender chest, grab my elytra. Wait, what's in here? Not my elytra, okay. I've still got the frog lights and the trap doors in here. Did I leave my elytra in any of these ones? No. Did I leave it in the frog lights? No. Okay. Should be one in the ender chest. Right. Rockets. Oh, don't know why I'm doing that. Right. Eat some food. Right, and let's go see if we can find this weird ass tree. So we need to fly. That way, okay. Okay, okay, we're on the map, we're on the map. Look for a tree that doesn't belong. Well, there's this one, right? It's got to be this one. Right, I, don't, I am just going to go to sleep. Because the night is dark and full of terrors. And I don't want a treasure hunt in the dark. <sighs> Look, it's surrounded by froggies as well. Aren't they cute? Hello, little guy. Oh, look at them all. Right, this is a tree that doesn't belong. Okay, let's just examine all around it. Okay. Right. Um. Down here, is there anything on top of the tree? See if we got might need to whip out the hole. Alright, let's Oh 
Oh, there's a barrel. There's a barrel. There's a barrel. <gasps> Yay! Oh, thank God. Extra fireworks. <gasps> Zombie heads. Skeleton skulls. Creeper heads. And a book by a Manchu. Right. Congratulations, I didn't make this one easy to find, but you're only halfway. Can you follow the clue to the real treasure? Oh my god, there's another part. Oh my god. The past is buried, but not forgotten. You'll find some bones that are not so rotten. The past is buried, but not for. I am really bad at riddles. The past is buried, but not forgotten. You'll find some bones... That are not so rotten. Bones. The only thing I can think of, like the past is buried, that makes me think of like a trail ruins. Bones that are not so rotten makes me think of a skeleton farm. Past is buried but not forgotten. You'll find some bones that are not so rotten. Do I need to look around here? I wonder if there's a trail ruins nearby and my cat just dropped the remote off the couch. With a massive clang. Thank you, ghost. Right, it doesn't look like there'd be a trail ruins anywhere near here, though. And... Uh, there's two... There's two areas where there's skeletons that I know of, and one of them is... At Silly's base, there is a skelly spawner. Uh, and then at Married in Minecraft's base, there is a skelly spawner. The past is buried but not forgotten. <gasps> I think I might know, but I'm not going to say because I could. I could very well be wrong. But I think I might know what it is. So here's spawn. This is our little cemetery for uh, past divergence. Let's just have a look in here. No. My bad. Sorry, guys. Not it. Family pants. What the hell? <laughs> Family pants. Oh, brilliant. Cat's prize. Oh, I can't believe I worked that one out all by myself. <gasps> Yay! Is there anything in this one? I right, just had to double check just in case. <laughs> Family pants. <laughs> oh, that was like I honestly I was thinking about like skeleton spawners with the bones and like past I was thinking maybe it was something to do with the divergent season one map, but I don't know that, that this this was a good call. The past is buried but not forgotten. It took me obviously a long time to think 
of the cemetery. So thank you so much, Amanju. That definitely was a brain like clogger, that one. So, <laughs> so thanks for watching, guys, and I'll catch you in the next one. Goodbye.